Social studies got a lot more interesting at Anoka High School this week. Our Jennifer Anderson was there as students witnessed a once in a lifetime lesson in law from the Minnesota Supreme Court. The highest court of the land. We have one case for argument this morning, the state of Minnesota versus Edstrom. Landed at Anoka High School this week. Is that a reasonable rule of law that could be? The Minnesota Supreme Court convened inside Anoka High School. An expectation of privacy. About 850 students watched. I thought it was really cool, especially as someone who is interested in being a lawyer. And learned. I think for anyone who saw it today and wants to go into law, this is really like kind of the best opportunity to look back on and be like, oh yeah, that's that's kind of how it works. The Supreme Court heard oral arguments from an actual case inside Anoka's auditorium. Afterwards, the justices fielded dozens of questions from curious students. We were the first class to go all the way through this school. So we Justice Margaret Chudich turned out to be the surprise headliner of the day <laughs> when she revealed in grand fashion where her true loyalty lies. Chudich herself is a graduate of Anoka. I was very proud. I was like, okay, this is my high school and look at these smart kids. Because I thought they really asked very intelligent questions, uh, really thoughtful questions and, um, you know, meaningful, meaningful questions. So I, I was delighted to see that. I thought it was super interesting. It's kind of like a once in a lifetime kind of thing. Junior Kitri Lindbergh came away inspired which is ultimately the purpose for the traveling court. When I went to this school, I really didn't think of being a lawyer. It didn't occur to me. And so I'm hoping there are other Margaret Chudiches out there who, you know, thought, saw this and thought, you know, I could, I could do this. That's always something that's kind of been at the back of my mind, like, oh, that'd be really cool to do that. And now seeing it, it makes my dreams almost like seem more possible. Since 1995, the Minnesota Supreme Court has taken oral arguments to more than 40 schools throughout the state. This was the first time court convened at Anoka High School. Students from several schools in the Anoka Hennepin District attended the event.